Okay, so I'm continuing with this save file. I have updated the experimental version. So we're still playing as Russ Reynolds III, with his bizarre name. A jackrabbit. Yeah, I'm not sure what those are. But, um, yeah, so today I'm going to pop across to that gas station. I say pop across. I'm going to probably fight my way there in a bloody struggle for survival. I don't know, the streets seem pretty empty though. Alright, I see a zombie. Where is it? West. That's where I'm going. Yeah, all the wheels are undercarriages now. That's interesting. That's quite a few zombies there. Um, okay, so there's bookcases behind all these windows here. I don't want to walk towards them anymore. And I have to... Alright, let's just get in this window. Let's see if I can crowbar it, so... Hey, there we go. So, I can stand here. Might as well... Fingerless gloves. Uh, better protection than the ones I'm wearing, I think. So I'm still wearing those medical gloves, am I not? Where are they? No? Ah, there they are. Scratched medical gloves. Yeah, get rid of them. Get the fingerless gloves on. That should not encumber my hands, I should think. Oh, actually, you know, those zombies are probably going to try and smash their way through this window, are they not? Uh, let's just open the window, let them in. It's the same uh, movement cost. So, okay, that's a nice thing. Yeah, they do seem... Oh, yeah, there you go. I didn't hear it uh, smash its way in here. That must have already been in here. What's on the uh, Time magazine? Right, I'm going to have to duck out the door, I think. Well, there's a crow pestering them. Help me, crow! Smash! Pew! Look at that! Blood everywhere. Okay. Uh, uh, some stuff in the way. Okay. This is actually quite easy. This doesn't seem to take any turns, this menu. It's a little bit uh, unbalanced in that respect. So let's try and coax them back over. Mmm, grape drink. <laughs> What's that? Alpha male quarterly. Okay. Hmm. Try and coax them back over here. Hello, I'm over here. Come on. Here, zombie, zombie, zombie. Oh, shit. I got in that window quickly. Come on. Yep, so, so far, no crashing. That's nice. Where are those bodies going? On the bookcase, though? Ah. God damn it. How long does it take to move furniture? One minute. Yeah, I think these zombies are going to be here in less than a minute. So, we'll just wait. And... There we go. We are killing them in two hits here. It's quite nice. The combat knife is very good. It's a melee weapon. If you have the strength to not have it get stuck in stuff. So, are you coming? I'm over here. Don't want to go in that window, mate. You must come in this window. Any more? Come on. Yeah, plenty of zombies today. This, uh, the road tiles look a little bit strange, don't they? It looks a little bit like it's supposed to be water. That's okay, though. Okay, move furniture. Move that. Move it that way. The bookcase collides with something. Well, stop then. I don't know how to let go of it. Ah, right, we just press the capital G. Oh, this is new. Ah, and it puts the one at the top of the list on capital B, so I can just keep pressing it. That's very nice, actually. I like that. Very nice indeed. Spray cans. They come with charges, but then... Um, 
when you make the spray can flamethrower, you actually have to charge it with stuff, which I find a little bit odd. Alright, um... You know, I might as well check the rest of this house. What is that? Salt water. Grab that. I do need some bottles for my current mission. A gallon jug. Would be nice if I could carry it. Protein powder. Uh, no thanks. My gains, bruh. What's that? Uh, so in kit, I have about five of those. <laughs> I've unloaded the... Ah, yeah, houses all have basements now. I believe they have zombies inside them. But I have night vision, and they do not. So we'll do okay down here, I think. Blimey, how big is it down here? Dirt, rock floor, okay. That's a lot of counters. Is this a bunch of drugs? Oh, hell yes. Someone's growing cannabis down here. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> this is amazing. Yeah, you wouldn't grow cannabis in your basement, though, I don't think. It'd be a bit cold for him, you know? And um, you would need lots of lights, obviously. Anyway, well, there's enough weed to last me a million years, but... I don't know, it's not the most useful drug, really. Where are those zombies? Just south, okay. Ignore those. Yeah, I didn't, um... What's in there? Is that a first aid kit? Lovely. Crowbar. There we go. Let's grab that. Is there nothing in the toilets? Just water. Oh, there's some vitamins in there. Hold on, what else is there? Aspirins. Dayquil. Okay, I'll grab those. Yep. I'll just grab the... Oh, fuck. Um, shit. Bit fucking trap there, aren't I? I'm gonna have to walk through this spit. Close that door, slow it down a bit. Uh, fruit juice. Hmm. French fries. Ooh, a pickle. Some grapes. There's lots of lovely stuff in here, and I can't carry any of it. <laughs> well, that's unfortunate. Now, I hope those mushrooms in the houses are the edible types. Where's the door out of here? Oh, here it is. Alright, grab that lighter. Okay, got some zombies to the west. And some drug dealer corpses as well, I think. So yeah, that spitter is now smashing its way through that house. Alright. Yeah, I was kind of hoping that there wouldn't be that many zombies around here, but... Wow, check that out. A five ton actually workable vehicle. <laughs> uh, well, I'm not wasting the gas on that. Right, so we got a spitter coming our way. Let's stand behind these doors, because that, because they are un impassable when they're closed. You open the wreckage's sliding door. Uh, it's clearly not open now. Ah, there we go. Is it dead? There we go. Now oh, it's dead. Now they should all be stepping onto that pool of acid. I don't know, there doesn't seem to be a different tile for open doors, actually. The zombie dies. Can't do that while on board. Ah. Oh. Could in the last version. But anyway. Good lord, it seems to take an age to get past these doors. For the zombies, anyway. Come on. There we go. Did a lot of critical damage here. Oh, fuck. So, yeah, I was just trying to see if that was open, but... I think he's trying to get through that one, is he? Yeah, he must have been. Bloody hell. 
No, don't miss. Hey. Hey. <laughs> it's okay. I'm getting them all. And a couple of hits before they even hit me, for the most part. I don't have any... Yeah, being tired doesn't really affect you in any way. It's a bit strange that you can just kind of ignore that for the most part. Is there a zombie there? Yeah. Whoops, didn't mean to press that one. Just always end up waiting a turn when I don't really mean to. Can't butcher while driving, for Christ's sake. Okay, let's move all that then. And there should be a bunch here as well. Let's move all those. Check every tile around me. That should be all of them, I guess. Auto save. Hopefully I don't have as much use for that today as I did last time. Good god. Exacto knife. Mm, reasonably useful. Yeah, just don't have any room for anything at the moment. So right now we're after some gasoline so I can fuel up that armored car because... Fucking zombie dog. Let's get inside the car. Is that a board? Is it just trying to smash through a board now? Right, quarter panels. I think they are... yeah, they're impassable. So... Uh, kind of forever invincible there unless I open one of the doors. Of course I would starve to death eventually if I just stopped on a car for all time. Oh shit. See that there? Because it's highlighting the tile and it's a bit annoying. See if I if I push in that direction and there's no zombie there then Come on, stupid fucking zombie dog. Fine, I'll open that door then. God. Can I watch that? No, uh, of course not. Yeah. It's a good way of passing the time actually, just <laughs> moving between these tiles. Oh I didn't I didn't know it was a child, did I? I couldn't tell. The tiles are exactly the same. Okay. Can I drag this car? I could push it, I'm fairly certain. Car is too heavy for you to budge. I mean, if it had wheels, that is, it's hard to tell now. Yeah, it does have wheels. Uh, so I'm gonna move these corpses again, like so. There we go. Watch, uh, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Uh. So there's swimmer zombies to the south somewhere. But I don't need to worry about that. I think it's far enough away. Baseball caps. Pointless. I wonder if that uh, stops the sun from glaring though. In your eyes. I would presume that it does. So yeah, that's the first lot of NyQuil that I've found. Wowzers, look at all this. Is this cannabis? Methamphetamine. Uh, some shotgun switchblade. Ugh. Hiccups, as always. Adderall, where's that? I'll grab that. That's very useful. Apparently it's very addictive. Uh, that's true in real life, I guess. Most stimulants are pretty addictive, because they... the way they Copper tubing. Interesting. Yeah, just the way they act on your brain, basically. It's very addictive, but... I've never actually been addicted to them in this game. Okay, we got a zombie brute coming our way. Where's that coming from? Oh god, it's so slow. Right. I can't tell which one it is, because it's not... Just a swimmer zombie. Yeah, some of the little sprites. There's a zombie brute. So yeah, it's just kind of bigger. See, for a lot of them they have... the colour being the colour of the Z symbol. I think that works well. 
So, um, yeah, I'm just going to open this door and <laughs> wait for them to smash their way through the car because they're stupid. Uh, we've got a zombie dog coming along as well. So I'm going to have to move there. There we go. Swimmer zombies aren't too hard to kill. Ah, how's that zombie dog moving through the fucking windscreen? Must be smashed. Yeah, it is. Oh well. Come on, die. There we go. So I'm taking this nice and slowly because I don't want to have that zombie brute in my face. Is this him here? No. I don't think he's made his way over here, has he? No, he's still hanging out in the park with all the child zombies. <laughs> it's pretty funny, actually. I don't know how many swimmers this pool spawns. Yep. Come on. Ah, quit trying to quit trying to smash through the bloody front frame. Uh, there's so many smashing messages. It's hard to see when the zombie dies. <laughs> as soon as zombie dies, a zombie child sinks into the deep water. <laughs> All right, I think the. Wait, scarred zombie? That's interesting. You usually find those in beehives. Is this it here? Yep. Yeah, I did find a beehive just to the north. I haven't been near it, but no doubt I will at some point because they are quite nice. Oh shit, here comes the zombie brute. Oh, come on. Fuck. Biting my torso. Zombie brute dies. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to duck out of the car, I guess. Oh, come on. Aha. Uh -huh. Bloody hell. Keep getting bitten. Yeah, my armor is protecting me. I don't have any painful bites or any horrible condition stuff. Come on, I'm right here! Stupid thing. <laughs> oh man, this is ridiculous. They're all just trying to smash their way through the front of the car. Alright, let's, uh. I'm still faster than them. So let's just go get in a window. Uh, you know, don't broke it if it ain't. Don't fix it if it ain't broken. Yeah, don't broke it if it ain't fixed. What? My brain's not in right today. What? Missing twice in a row? That's disgraceful. So, i got a lighter here. What's that? A flashlight. Cigarettes. Might as well. I'll we'll smoke one up while we're waiting. Yeah. Yeah, cigarette addiction is probably one of the easier ones to manage in this game. Because, um, yeah, there's so many cigarettes everywhere. Ah, uh, come on. Get over it. There we go. Alright. So, what have we got? Zombie soldier. Hmm, did they kind of mix up the special zombie types in town? Because, yeah, it seems like I'm getting zombies that you don't normally see in a town. Like zombie soldiers, scarred zombies. I mean, I doubt that this beehive up here would be spawning scarred zombies down here. Oh shit, what's... oh, that's me. <laughs> I was just about to say, what's that fucking zombie there? What's that white one? Uh, it's me. Uh, I don't know. Where are we? Money bundles. Let's see if we have time to much of this. 
Uh, we do, but um, what's around this corner? Ah, uh, well, we'll just smash the corpses then. All corpses are thoroughly pulped. Oh, okay. That's nice. I didn't uh, expect them all to go at the same time. Right, now there is a bunch of bloody corpses under this car. Uh, and <laughs> I don't know which tiles they're on. I guess this tile. What? Alright, there's a bunch here then, I guess. Ah. Uh, yeah, we don't want any of that, I guess. So, right. Okay, so I can smash them while they're on the car as well. That's cool. So what's in this back seat here? Get items from seat, yeah. There's a bottle of ketchup in it. How strange. Anyway, how many empty bottles do I actually have? Two, that is appalling. Let's empty out this salt water. Because, yeah, it's not that necessary. I think it does have its uses, but... Um, I'm going to eat this pickle. Nom 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 nom. I enjoyed it. Well, there you go. Use the gasoline pump on the plastic ball. Yep. Uh, I changed the letter of the bottles. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, right. So the other plastic bottles I have have useful stuff in them. So I don't want to tip that away. Yeah, I mean, until... Like, I can purify water now, but I don't exactly have the most reliable source of water to purify. I mean, I guess there's a swimming pool here, but I don't want to come up here every time I need a drink, so, yeah. Right, before it starts getting dark, which will be in a few hours, I'm going to walk back to that armoured vehicle. And, uh, yeah, I need to figure out what kind of ammunition those turrets use. I'm not entirely sure that I should use the turrets. <laughs> Because they're extremely indiscriminate about what they shoot at. Like, they'll just shoot at things through um, through you, through the car, through anything. It doesn't matter. Alright, let's grab some fresh blueberries. Mmm. What is that thing? Oh, it's a jackrabbit. Uh... Yeah, it's it's ignoring me, I think. I'm not sure. Right, that's a minefield. Now, this is... This pissed me off a little bit. These are mounds of dirt, but as it just says there, it just says dirt. And it's the same movement cost. Yeah, but they're mines. <laughs> you don't want to step on them. Because, yeah, my buried landmines used to just be under mounds of dirt. And you would... Um, you would see the mounds of dirt and go, ah, we don't want to step on those. But then when you examine those and just see that it's just dirt, you might just be like, well, that's fine then, isn't it? Oh, wow. So, is there reinforced windshield? Right. Okay, it just looked like there was a lot of items on the top there. But, uh, let's fill this tank. Fill, fill, fill. 20% gas? Okay, that's okay. Why is this door open? Vehicle controls here. Regain control of the armored car. Woo, nearly. I got an armored car. So, let's see how it deals with shrubs. Okay. Shrubs are okay. The giant wolf spider is stunned by being hit by the car. It didn't get died. It didn't get died. Uh, okay. Right, is that the deer there? Just to the. What is that? What is that? 
That is a deer. That tile... It doesn't look like a deer, to be honest. Oh well. Uh, let's... Let's go back to the gas station. There will be millions of zombies there when I'm driving up in an armoured car, really, but... Oh, shit! Okay, maybe they aren't mines. Well, I just went right over them. <laughs> uh, well. Maybe they're just anti-personnel mines. What is that W? A wolf. Why is it not? Oh, because it doesn't do that. Yeah. Oh, there's a pack of wolves there. Right. Wow. Everything's just a little bit slower on the SDL version. It's not. No, it's not painfully slow. It's just you know everything just happens so quickly on the Curses version that um, you're just used to things happening instantly. You know. Like, j even just loading the game up, like, it, there's a, a loading time now. <laughs> it's only a couple of seconds, but can I get in here? You lose control of the armored car. Oh, fuck off. Well. Okay. Whoa. You <laughs> see that car wobbling around then? That was weird. Alright, so are they coming over here? Yep. A clang and a shudder. I pick the one fucking gas thing that is empty. Okay. It did fill it up somewhat though. So, turn right a little bit. Oh shit. Yeah, it's kind of hard to steer things, I suppose. Um, turn left? No. Nope. <laughs> Whatever, that'll do. We'll just, um. Shit. So I need to let go of the controls there and then. Alright, we'll use this gas pump here. Oh shit. Zombie dog! Wish my turrets worked! Ah, <laughs> uh, come on! So yeah, it seems like all the zombie children finally got out, did they? Uh, well, we'll turn that way. Oh, fucking hell. Did my car collide with something? Oh, shit. Am I in a skid? Which way am I facing? Collides into zombie dog. Is that not doing any damage? It's not saying. Ah, there we go. Heavily injured. Yeah, we're kind of swerving a little bit as well, though. Come on. Turn. Seriously? Oh, come on. Okay. Let's just get out and kill these zombies, I guess. Oh! I didn't realize that was still moving. Oops. Let's actually pull the handbrake. Then get out. Come on, little children. Yeah, making all of the noise here. Killing zombie child fills you with guilt. It's a new message. Ah, oh, Christ. Come on then, get over it. What's that next to the... Is that... That's the salt water, isn't it, that I... Dumped. I can see that it's salt water from all the way over here, that makes sense. Are you trying to get through my... Whoa, okay. Alright. Come on. Take your time. Ah, oh, come on. Is this... What is wrong with it? Is it blind or something? It must be. Okay. That just wasn't hitting me at all. Let's, um... Right. Now, can I just fill up my car without, uh... 
Any interruptions, please? Without any shrubs. Fuck. Want to do a full circle here just to come around and oh, oh, oh. <laughs> just pull the handbrake there because that's gonna crash into the gas pump. Well, you can crash into the gas pump, kind of okay, and not really make it explode. So, hooray! It's all walls of question marks everywhere. So hold on, what are these? What is that? Oh, it's a trunk. Okay. So, what can I do with the controls here? I can honk the horn. Okay. <laughs> Turn on the headlights anyway. Let's honk the horn. Honk! Alright. Well, I guess that didn't attract too much attention. Whoop! Hey, what's that? Oh, yeah. Is that um zombie dog corpse there? Is it? No, uh, hold on. Do nothing. Pull the handbrake. Cause you gotta make sure all the corpses are pulped. Yeah, there you go. Well, if you got that one right, would have come back to life and tried to kill me next time I came to fill up my car. Uh. So it's time to hit the road. Oh shit! Time to hit the cars in the middle of the road. I'm colliding something. Whoa, that's a big skid. Handbrakes, handbrakes, handbrakes. Okay. Let's uh, back her up. Oh, the wreckages are still moving. No, come on, no. No, this is bullshit. Two fucking cars. Alright, we just needed to steer. It's okay. Alright, let's not be quite so reckless. We can go fairly slow on the roads without having to crash through obstacles. And then speed up when we got a bit of space. Okay, so I'm gonna swing to the south here and go down this road. Ah, uh, not through the buildings. <laughs> not through the buildings. Okay. Did I already check these corpses? Ah, there's a bunch of traps down there. Uh, no, I'm not entirely sure that I did actually. So we got EMP grenades there. I most probably would have grabbed those, but I'm driving at the moment, so there we go. My blistering 40 word a minute typing speed. So yeah, well, there's an evac shelter. I'm very tempted to crash through that, just because it'll be amusing when uh, when I load up another game. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, it's kind of a a risk reward thing with exploring, I guess. When I mean basically you spawn at an evac shelter that you've discovered. So I found a lab here actually. Oh shit. Let's just slam on the brakes in a hilariously over the top fashion. <laughs> just stepping through the frame there, you know, like you do. Now one of the doors is broken actually. But yeah, you always spawn in an evac shelter that you've discovered, or a brand new one if it's a brand new map. So the more evac shelters you discover, the more places that you have to uh, spawn at. So yeah, if you want to keep spawning in the same shelter and have all your loot back and stuff, then um, you want to not really explore that much. Uh, no, I don't want to disarm the goo pits because it will probably start spawning goos. Okay, now I can start using my night vision, I guess. 
Oh, this is a big room. Yeah, I'm not sure I can be bothered uh, searching a lab now. I want to play with my car some more, so. That is for Elise and Dates when we don't have an inventory full of stuff, which I currently do. So, off we go. Whee! Crunching through the shrubs. Very nice. It's a big open space here. Let's open her up. Cruise control will not let me go above the safe speed. So I don't need to worry about that. I do need to worry about coming across a... <laughs> yeah, that. What is this? Garages. Couple of garages. A cathedral. Cool. Now is that one of those hazardous waste places? It is indeed. They do often have cool stuff in them. Like, uh, actually they have radiation in them, do they not? Well, I have picked robust genetics, and I have iodine tablets, so... Yes, it is quite tempting. There's some more traps there, we don't want to drive right towards them, but... There's a bunch of trash in it anyway, so... Yep, yep, yep. Okay, let's slow the hell down. That's a tree. Don't want to hit the tree. <laughs> oh my word. Uh, okay. So uh, I'm actually going to cut this down.